Good morning to you. Welcome to another vlog. I'm here with Pearly. Look at this beautiful mermaidy hair. What are we doing today? We're going to Little Mermaid You're see the little in London. In London. And you look so mermaidy gorgeousy. I love it. And you've got a headband that's like bubbles. Yeah. And this is all floaty like a mermaid. We've got these earrings in. We're going to go and have a really lovely time, aren't we? Yeah, it's got some see-through bits. It's got an underskirt as well. It's just the three of us today, Pearl, Liam and I. Yeah, um, yeah no Darcy today, I'm sadly. You go and see the cat, that's fine. Um, and I thought I would just like to vlog this because I would like to remember this. I'm loving, loving, loving vlogging at the moment. And I'm particularly enjoying just vlogging on nice days. Um, so I'm going to vlog this, come along and enjoy. I always film these buildings when we come into London because I just think they look so nice. They remind me of like all the TV programmes I like to watch, like Bridgerton and Downton. I don't think these are very Downton here, are they? Maybe they're more Bridgerton don't actually know I just think they're lovely and it makes me feel nice and gives me a dopamine hit because it's just so lovely I've undone the window I really mean business now would you just look at it look at that just look at it that was lovely that was look joyous this gorgeous little girl you look so mermaidy pearly you look so gorgeous we did lots of plaits in her hair last night look gorgeous look at that isn't that pretty pearly yeah. it's like giant sequins isn't it mm -hmm. that's gorgeous she wants to see what she said. Can I try? Come on then, you see if you can copy her. See if you... <laughs> it's mesmerising, isn't it? Was there anything on the other side? No. No? <laughs> Should we see what else we can find? No, you don't, you're, not, you're not supposed to climb on it. <laughs> There's Daddy. Toy store, what do you want to look for in there? Toys, Toys that makes sense. Buy some. Oh, well, we can have a look at some, can't we? Yeah. Let's go. And buy one. Hmm. That'll be enough. We'll see. Yeah, one is only one. You're <laughs> such a negotiator. <laughs> Pearly. <laughs> yeah, Pearly once opened it. I'll leave a link to that. I don't know if I did a YouTube video or maybe just Instagram, but you, you rang the bell, didn't you? Yeah. Can you remember it? But I did it. You did. Well I done. Got ice cream. <laughs> you did get an ice cream, yeah. Pearly, <laughs> sorry, can my little girl just there you go. There you go. The finest toy shop in the world. Now two hundred and sixty-two. wants a penguin, a cuddly penguin. Oh, that that is a very big penguin. Is there a smaller version of that penguin? I think I did see one. You did see one? Oh look, oh he's lovely isn't he? He's very soft. Let's see how much is he going to set mummy back. That's it, we're on. So we've come up to the next floor because the floor below is kind of for younger younger children oh they are doing nails oops let's have a look shall we they've got a lot of magic mixies these are really expensive but they're so clever I still can't really work out how they do it we've had I think we've had this one and um it was amazing it's such a good toy it was like a like a definitely like a main Christmas present kind of toy but definitely a good one did you even come to Hamley's if you didn't go in the Sylvanian family's bus the lights, yeah, it did turn on out here as well. You're controlling it. Oh, look at the giant Sylvanian. Which one are you going to go for? Oh, that's it, you've done it. Look, there she is. 
Oh, red. She looks like Becky. She does look like Becky, doesn't she? Yeah. Here's some of the Barbies they've got on offer at the moment. I'm really looking forward to the Barbie film coming out. Oh, I like her. I like her pink hair. More over here as well. Oh my gosh. This would have been heaven to me when I was little. What do you want to see? A fishy thing. Okay. Oh yeah. That's good. We're going to see a fishy thing later, aren't we? We're going to see the film. Little Mermaid. They'll be fishing that. Good girl. Can we get a small bag as well, please? Thank you. Card, please. Thank you. Let's take the red carpet out, shall we? Such a fun store. What have you found? Noodles. <laughs> they're, they're real noodles. Can you see yourself? Hi. Hello. <laughs> it's all getting a bit busier now. We are in Piccadilly and we're going to go and have a look at the Piccadilly Waterstones. It's such a lovely, lovely waterstones. If you're ever in the area, take yourself there. I think it's like five floors. Oh, some sort of, is it like the Tour de France, but not in France? <laughs> There's some people that have like decorated their bikes like old and plain, so they've got music. It's a lot of fun. I wonder what this event is. If anyone knows, comment below. It's uh, May the 28th when I'm filming this. I think this video is going to go up in a week or so got a bit of a backlog of vlogs. All sorts of people, all ages. That's amazing. You never know what you're gonna find in London. Right, we're gonna to go to Waterstones now and I was saying that there's like five stories and once I even got afternoon tea there, I don't know if they still do that, but there was a cafe on the top floor and it was really good. We've got Liam? Yes, we do. Right, we're crossing. Okay, after all that hype about Waterstones, it's not open yet. Uh, if you're coming on a Sunday, come in the afternoon. We were too early, weren't we? We were early birds. Oh, Liam's on the phone. We've just come from there and we found this beautiful church courtyard. And we found a beautiful little fountain. Should we go and have a look, Pearly? Should we go and see it? That looks so pretty. It's amazing what you can find in London. Just next time you come to London, just allocate yourself half an hour just for a little walk around. And I promise you, you'll find something lovely. Wow, Pearl, that's so magical, isn't it? It's like something out of a Disney film, isn't it? Can I throw a coin in? Want to throw a coin in? Should we see if we've got any pennies? Yeah. That's some lovely colouring, Pearl. What are you drawing? A little penguin. A little penguin. Oh, there he is. An orange. Oh, his orange nose. Yeah, look, I can. That's clever. Well done. Cheers, gorgeous. Cheers. I've got my sweet, sweet nectar. So Pearly has got your favourite saucy pasta. That's what we call that. Yum yum. And this and over there is the moving noodles. Moving noodles, yeah. Okay. Thank you. So I've gone for the mushroom ravioli. Liam has gone for some sort of shrimpy prawny spaghetti. That would not serve me well. If you know, you know. And we've also got some bruschetta to share. Yum yum yum. Yeah, thank you. We've popped into Joe Malone. As you can see here, and I've bought a bottle of perfume, and they're very kindly engraving it. This is so, can you do this on all bottles or just the big ones? All bottles. All bottles, that's so cool. Yeah, the smaller one, you can put maybe just initial. Okay. The size. Yeah, there's not enough space. Yeah, otherwise that's so cool. Everything. I'm having mummy written on it just because I like being called mummy. <laughs> this is a cool little space I've got over there. It's fascinating, isn't it, Pearly? Mm -hmm. Yeah. yeah. Sometimes we'll host like floral oh, masterclass in here. That's so cool, I didn't know that. That is very sweet. I love that I'm having the lid done with an L as well. Excited. Penguin's bought some perfume, hasn't he? Yeah. <laughs> soap. Oh, and some soap, yeah. Some, peng some perfume and soap in the wild bluebell scent. Let's just a swan. Yeah. Little swan and a frog just over there. Thank you, right, thank you. Say, what do you say? Thank you. Bye. Do you feel so special? Thank, thank you. you. Wow, Pearl. Thank you. That was special, wasn't it? 
that was the loveliest Joe Malone experience I've ever had. Like, it was just a really beautiful store. I've not been in the Regent Street store, and I just felt like the staff really just like went above and beyond and engraved. It was all just so lovely, wasn't it? That was really, really nice. Um, we're now going to head to Soho um, to see the screening of The Little Mermaid, which is what we are in London for. We've been invited down by the NSPCC, and I know that most of you watching will know uh, that I'm an ambassador with the NSPCC, the Ambassador for Childhood. And um, we did that big live stream last year and raised all that money. And um, I went down early this week and did a panel and all sorts of stuff um, with them. Um, so they invited us to watch this, and I'm going to leave a link to the NSPCC if you want to check them out. This is a very busy street, but I'm going to leave some NSPCC stuff below if you would like to read more or know more about my campaign. Now I know um, because it's a cause very close to my heart for lots of reasons that I won't go into today but yes any chance I can raise a bit of awareness I like to so I'll leave that below for you. The screening's being held at the Ham Yard Hotel we've just turned into the little courtyard how cute is this with the lights honestly every corner you turn in London there's always something so nice this is such a cool venue we came here for um, a sky event did you see the pictures for the sky the portable door film look how cool is this juice thing they've got and I can see there's popcorn down there can you touch the arm I don't think you can reach it oh gosh okay okay I know London's amazing and I'm showing you all the big sites but also can we just take a moment to appreciate this toilet like I opened the door thinking it would be a whole room full of all the cubicles no just my own little toilet with with all the amenities I best go because if there's they've gone in the other one Oh, little amenities, what's this? What amenity is this? Just a sanitary bag in a, in a little packet. How lovely, how utterly delightful. I don't know how to say this like delicately, but I need to know where the good toilets are places. Like I'm a toilet girly. No, I'm not a toilet girly. I've tried to make that cute. I'm just one of those people I want to know that there's toilets where I'm gonna stop. You know what I am? You, you, there's people out there that, those that know, know. Okay, thank you, good night. Movie Club um, is organised by the Childline Board, um, in particular thanks to Lynn Miller and Tom Tomazzi who can't be here to, with us today, but who organised it. The club has raised over a million pounds towards Childline um, over the last 12 years, which is absolutely amazing. It's amazing. If you want to donate, you can also go on nsbcc.org.uk. Um, all your contributions will be hugely welcome, so thank you for that. Oh my gosh, if I'm crying, that's so good. So we've just come out of the cinema, and I'm going to give you my full thoughts once we find a quiet spot, but oh my goodness, I am blown away by that film. Right, we've found a semi-quiet spot. It's quite hard to find a quiet spot in central London, um, but I just wanted to say that was such an amazing film. Do you want to share any thoughts? I thought it was really beautifully done. Yeah, it was lovely. I must say, I'm not really, like, fair to say, I'm not really a film buff. I don't watch a lot of films, do I? No. At home mainly because the internet has ruined my attention span. Are any of you the same, that like after a while your mind goes? Uh, but it kept my interest the whole time. I thought it was beautiful. I thought the adaptation was really true to the first film, which I appreciated. I also appreciated that it wasn't really super scary. I remember when it's a kid, those like eels with the one glowing eye. They were terrifying, but they were like, it was okay. But yeah. you know, I did watch it first when I was like, seven and now I'm 38 so maybe that's helped with like <laughs> scary levels. Yeah. Pearly, what did you think to the film? It was good. What did you, what was your favourite part of it? I liked it when my, the, the good mermaid smashed the necklace. Yeah, that was a good moment wasn't it? What was the good mermaid's name, you remember? Um, Ariel. Ariel. Have you watched the cartoon film one? No. I think, I think you have, you know where they're like under the sea, she's got red hair. 
Which one do you prefer, the cartoon one or the one we just watched? The one we just watched. The next generation. And the cartoon one. And the cartoon equal. Yeah. You should be a diplomat. I love both of them. Oh, you're such a good girl. Like right, I think we're going to go and find the car. But I like the car. And, oh. I like the cartoon one more. <laughs> Did you? Okay. I think we're going to go and find the car and head home. What a lovely, lovely summery day in London. Look at this gorgeous door with the massive flowers. How lovely is that? I almost want to jump out the car and go and do some photos there. Oh, I love it. Oh, very shaky now. Sorry. Apologies about the uh, shadow. Is that better? There we go. We're just driving out of London now where we're talking about uh, the film and how much we loved it. Things that I wanted to say that I loved. I loved that without any spoilers. Um, although is it really spoilers if like the original film came out 30 years ago? Um, I loved that Scuttle in this was a girl. Loved that. Um, I thought the casting was perfection. I thought Ariel's acting just through her face when she didn't have a voice was just incredible um we both said that we really liked the under the sea scene didn't we that was really good that was really good and liam said he really liked titan is it titan or triton triton, triton. triton. Bardo. yeah you liked him a lot um i thought he was good and i also appreciated that his armor his like clothing armor was made of mother of pearl and i am mother of pearl so i always spot a bit of mother of pearl um what else did i really love i loved all the costuming i loved the set design for the castle um oh i loved the little cameo i won't say any more on that one because that will be a little spoiler but i loved there was a little cameo in there when you see it you'll know it and i loved that um yeah that's all i think that's oh we really 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 loved what's his face sebastian i loved his little mouth the way they moved his little mouth was great all right have you got anything to add? No, it was all good. It was all good. Right, me and my uh, fishy earrings will call it a day. Pearl, are you going to shout goodbye? Goodbye. Are you looking for snacks in there? <laughs> yeah. Thank you so much for watching. I uh, hope you enjoyed this video. Leave a friendly comment. Sorry about the lighting in this end bit. Uh, love you lots. Links below. Bye.